Hey, how's everyone doing? We're going to have a Dvar Torah now for Parshat Matot. In Parshat Matot, it discusses making promises and how you're not supposed to make a promise. In the way the Pasuk starts off and in introducing the concept of making promises is Zeha Davar Asher Tziva Hashem. This is a thing that Hashem commanded. If you look at throughout the entire Torah, the words Zeha Davar are only introduced, are only used one other time to introduce a mitzvah. So why here does the Torah use the phrase Zeha Davar to introduce the concept of promises and oaths? So I think about it, if you think, for all those who are working on their Shorashim over the summer, the Shorash Dalet Bez Resh can mean two things. It could either mean thing, Zeha Davar Shertziv Hashem, this is the thing that Hashem commanded, or Dalet Bez Resh, the Shorash can also be what? Speak. Excellent. Great. So Dalet Bez Resh can mean speak. So this is Zeha Davar, this is the words that you speak for Hashem. The Torah is coming to teach you a lesson about your words being so important, that the words that you choose to use, whether it be making a promise or not making a promise or just speaking, your, your words can be either used positively and ne or negatively. And the Torah is coming to teach us that we should always use our words positively. Hope everyone's having a great summer and Shabbat Shalom. See you soon. <laughs> Thank you.